Well, here we are back again. We're obviously down here at the uh, Pepper Mill, sitting in our incredible red couch, which is wonderful, which is Elvis Presley's seat. And of course, this is Vegas Live with Nino. And you can probably hear noise in the background, and that's because we're at the Pepper Mill. And they have guests, and they have people that come in, and it's, it's absolutely wonderful. I have Zaina Juliet with me. We had her on before, but I love to catch up with my guests just to see where they're going, what they've done. And she whispered in my ear something, because I don't like to know too much. I like it to be fresh. And she said something about she's got her own show going. Hey, Zaina, what's hey, going on? It's so good to see good you. Good to and see you're you. So beautiful. Oh, thank wow. you. You're beautiful. You look thank fabulous. You. Now, last you time so you had straight hair. I had straight hair. This hair, she's, time she's got curly hair. Yeah. My hair's the same. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> I've done nothing with mine. Yeah. But so, how's it going? What is this a new? You're obviously a new show. Yeah. Um. At this moment, I mean, you know, our friends were coming, but you know, they're late. But yeah, I have okay. a new show. Um. I, I have a television show coming on every Sunday on the CW. Network. It's called Zayn and Juliet and Friends at 11 o'clock. Oh, how lovely. But what we came That's here, a television show, not radio. It's a television show Wonderful. on CW. Yeah. Okay. But what I'm here to talk about today, yes. um, other than the music, because we won't have enough time to do all that. Yeah, we got time. Okay, <laughs> we always well, got time. Is because um, there's a new show, a new television series called okay. Shades of Sapphire. Shades and of Sapphire. I love the a, name. It's a production. It's not a Las Vegas production. However, it's being filmed in Las Vegas as the background and it's not like so much the strip. Well, there's the, so uh, much, so many places you can film here. Yes, so I mean, many it's amazing, places. gorgeous places. Place. They're already safe. You don't have to be Absolutely. And this director is directed by Conrad Glover. Okay. And produced by Cleo Flucker. And they are actually taking advantage of this beautiful city yeah. and casting some of the cast. It was a long casting in different states, but some of the cast that they have in the television series are local Vegas actors, not extras. Because normally you know how they I come know, they, in. I know, they like all this extra stuff. Yeah, but I'm, this time they actually actors. cast some of the actors for some of the main characters. Oh, that is... I've noticed that's happening more and more. I've noticed yes. that the talent agencies and the and the producers are right. actually saying we need lead parts. Exactly. And then they say they need extras. So yes. it's nice to see that the people in Vegas are sort of getting their yes. turn now. And this show will actually put a whole other um, eye on Vegas because normally it's like... Vegas is just the backdrop, but this story actually, the whole story takes place in Las now, Vegas. Now, aren't you playing kind of the lead in it, the leading lady? Well, my role, See? I play <laughs> Sapphire. I play the lead character. The lead character. And the whole story is based around her character. Okay. And she's a bad girl. But you're a not a bad girl. girl. <laughs> well, at first, I'm not a bad girl, but she's a bad girl, but a good girl. But a good girl, yes. What she is, is she's like a modern-day Robin Hood. Oh, what, really? Well, she's a gangster, but not really a gangster. She gives... So she does, she's, she's a playing bad a double girl. Side. Yeah, she's had many shades. You know, many shades. And many shades, shades of gray. Of <laughs> yes, but it's very powerful and intense. It's a lot of action. Is this a weekly series? It will be a, it, we're shooting the first eight episodes. We're going on episode number eight. Okay. And then after eight, we're going to be shooting another eight episodes. Isn't that amazing? It's, so, it's is this, is this amazing. kind of one of your bigger parts that you've played, or is it one of the... It's, you know, it's one of the bigger parts. One of the bigger yeah. Because I know you've done an awful lot in, in your films. time. Other yeah. films and everything. Yeah. What's the film that really sort of put you on the map and sort of, you know, got you out there? You know, I did a film with Stacey Keach. I oh, yes. co-starred with him in a film called Sea Wolf. I worked with Angela Bassett and all those people. I did something with her and uh, how still she's quite an actress that Angela Bassett she is an yeah. uh, outstanding yes, actress she is. I did some stuff I mean I've been doing it since I was a child yeah. when I started in the theater Okay. And I started doing. Oh, so she's a good background because they always say theater yeah. background is the best. I started in the theater at age five. Oh my goodness! So I've been on the stage ever since. Little tippy toeing around there, yeah, right? Yeah, it started from an early age. Now, was that your parents that did that, or were they in show business? Well, my parent, my whole family is in show business. Oh, and um, see, that's always the greatest yeah. age, you know. But I wanted to be a figure skater. And oh. so I, my mother, when she took me down to the skating ring and all this to sign me up, the lady told her there's no market for a, a black figure skater. So you got to be kidding! No, no, I'm serious. So after that, I how became. How old are you? Huh? How old are you? Don't tell him, mate. Okay. Well, that could have been. That, could, well, it could have been that far back no, that they would that, say no, that. No, not that far back. I, oh. I, went through, I went through the same thing, and even in my high school. But I went to school in Riverside, California. Yeah. But um, but what happened was, I said, Mom, that's okay. I'll did be you understand? Wait a second. Did you understand it when she said that? I understood it very well. 
were you I'm upset? Sure. My mother was upset. Well, since she would be upset, I mean, come upset. on. I mean, you yeah. know. Yeah. Well, a lot of, at that time, a lot of people couldn't tell what my mother, what her nationality was, because she's Creole. Okay. So her mother and parents come from um, half Germany and India. And in, in, yes. In, the Indian, the German, French. Yes. You know, and um, African. So they couldn't tell. They couldn't tell. But when they saw me, they knew. So, did you take more on your father's side than your mother's side? I do. I'm. I Cause she's beautiful. I, mean, I look like enough. both of them, actually. Yeah, both really. Them, yeah. Really. But right then is when I knew I wanted to be an actress. I told my mother, "Don't worry about it. I'm just going to be an actress." And so I told her to take me to. I told her. So I was cast in my first production uh, at age five. Oh how! Right after that. Right after. And so you were only like six years old when this happened. Yeah. And, but the funny thing is, you understood it. I understood it. Is that very well? well. I mean, I've got to say that because you went to school, but that wasn't even. Yeah. yeah. I mean, that I, I, didn't hit you at all badly at all. No, because uh, adults to me, adults at that time did crazy things. <laughs> yeah, well, they're still, crazy. Well, my mind like is like, they still still doing crazy things. Yes. So don't worry about it. Yes. It's still happening. Yes. So anyway, so getting off that subject and getting back onto what you're doing now. So you've got this lead in this sapphire, which is absolutely fabulous. Yes. And what is this show that you're doing yourself that, that you, you, is so, it? I, I, you know, I, you know, when I, Remember I talked about my other show, my concert, yes. and then it didn't happen. And so Do you know I had something? That she had house. a she had a show together a week before. And I'm not going to mention the guy's name. Or maybe no. I, do you want me to mention his name? No, maybe you don't not. have to mention it. No, we won't mention his name. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, whatever his fictitious name was is still whatever that may be. Doesn't matter. A week before the production, he what vanished. He vanished and pulled the show. And he pulled the show. Yes, and we and I had no. Had idea. he ever brought the show back with other people? No, he's just, I haven't he heard just from vanished. him since. Were you I sure? You said, did somebody kidnap him? I, I, I loved him dearly. Like, we were very close. And, oh. you know, not like in a relationship, but as a, you know, As a person. Yeah, but yeah. Yeah, you know, let me just say, when she just clarified something that was so beautiful. You know, when women seem to have a business relationship with a man, people always seem to put, relate that to having an affair. Well, well this doesn't <laughs> always have. It's like I'm, I'm sort of doing business with a lot of men at the moment, but yes. I'm not dating them. I'm not having anything to do with them. It's just a business to tell them. Oh, you're with them and you're having. I'm not having an affair with anybody. <laughs> you know what? People need to stop making so many assumptions. Assumptions, assumptions yeah. get you in trouble. Well, they get them in trouble. Yeah, I'm always protecting myself. No, yeah. I'm not doing that. I don't. Yeah, because absolutely. I don't. I'm too busy. Absolutely. I'm too busy doing what I need to do. So I don't. You know. But but people also like this little digging, little yeah. digging, little. Yeah. You you, you remind me of myself. <laughs> we think alike. Exactly. And it's like, you know, get off it. You know, I'm a businesswoman exactly. and I'm in business. And I've had that going on for years. Even when I was married, they used to say, oh, well, she's dating, yes. she's going to get around with this guy. I'm not fooling around any guy. Yes. But oh that happens all the, time, all the time. All the time. Now, yeah. even in show business, even putting your own show together, they even turn around, well, how can a woman do that? Yes. Um, that's another thing. So I think what I, I'm, I'm not putting any politics into any of this. I'm not going to put any harassment into any of this. But what I am going to say, Say, is that I think women now stepping up to mm -hmm. be women to be together. See, the problem is men work together, women don't. Yes, and that was, that was my whole movement. Remember when I told yeah. you before I was on my girl power movement? That yes. was what it was all about. And that's the problem. So that women out so there, nice. don't don't get this sort of. And I think you know, if we ever, you know, if we ever have boyfriends or whatever we have, the yes. last thing we ever do is bring them around to our friends. Yes. Not until we've got the whole relationship completely sealed and it's cemented in. in, it's locked in, that he won't go. And, you know, yes. because why do we have this going on? And in, and in show know. business, it must be really tough. It's and very well, because you're a singer, so it, is it tough out there for you to it's, kind of go through this web? It's very tough. In fact, that was it's been a problem that I've had for quite some time. Because you have, you're attractive and you're beautiful, and, you have and she's got certain talent. Certain females and, and that will try and go behind your back to sabotage oh, yeah. your shows, to sabotage your. I have it all the time. On. Right now, and we can be with working you, together. Yes. And you'll be sabotaged. And making beautiful And they have magic, these little yeah. things. They, they two or three of them get together yes. and they chit chat and chit chat and do all these crazy and things. Create things. And they create these problems and all this crazy stuff. Because they're like, not doing what we're doing because they're so busy worried about what the other girl is doing instead of working on what they could be doing. Yeah, that's what I always so say. I so put girls, my focus you know, on hey, come on, get it together. Yeah. Get rid of all that garbage because believe me, it's garbage. Yeah. And the only thing it's going to do is destroy you. So don't do it. Yeah, don't do it. Don't we gotta do work it. together. Yeah, let's work together. It's girl you power. Know, girl power. <laughs> but that's what they've done in Hollywood. They've got yes. these 
bunch of women together now and they've yes. all decided to work together and I really really think that's a great idea yes. and I think it's wonderful. I've been, been on not, that movement for quite some time. Well good for you. Well, see I don't, I'm not jealous of anybody because if me someone either. wants to copy me good luck to them. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> good luck to you. You really don't want to be like me believe me you really don't. I know. Well, 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 no, well, well, yeah. Number one they don't have the accent. <laughs> <laughs> they, don't, they don't have this crazy accent. So. Very true. But there's nothing like competition, though. Yes, nothing there's like nothing it. Like yes. Com so what are you doing now? What is your, your, and then we'll close out. What are you got going right now? Right now, you know, I have my TV show on yes. CW Stuff Network, like, yes. but I'm focusing on Sapphire. I'm okay. focusing on this t television series because I can tell you it's going to be very powerful. Yeah, and I think that's a good idea. Put yes, all your energy into something. Powerful. You've already got it. Yeah. You're already the lead. You're already yes. up there. So, so, so make sure that is your... It's funny you should say because if you stay focused on that one thing, all those other little Everything things will come happens, in. Yeah. They all come in together yes. and they all work together. I believe the show is strong enough to have uh, win some awards or be at least nominated. Wonderful. How wonderful. Yeah. And if it does that, where does it have to go to get that? Well, I just think because it's already got distribution. Yes. So it's going to be on like all the Netflix and all those type of shows. Oh, it's all on Netflix. So oh, it's going to be... It's the, the director Conrad Glover has done a lot of success. Glover, is he? Projects. Is he? Uh, He's supposed to be. They're supposed to be coming here. The no, but is he related to Glover? You know, I'm not sure. Because he could be. He could be. Yeah. Well, his last name is Glover. He could Hello. be. Uh, he uh, could you be. never know. He could be the son. Because yeah. their family is all be, in He could business. be the son. He could be the brother. He could be anybody. Yes. He could be. There you go. Yeah. Okay. He, if anybody wants to book for your singing, how can they reach you? You can go to my site at z a i n a j u l i e t t e dot com, zanajuliet dot com, or you can contact me on my business phone, which is three one zero. What is it? Nine six seven. <laughs> 310-967-9767. There you go. She's giving her number uh, out. Everybody says to me, Nino, you yeah. shouldn't put your number out there. I said, listen, I'm out there. So they're going to find me anyway. Well, so that, that take number, the number is just for that. Yes, no, that's, it's, wonderful. It's that's wonderful. That's wonderful. It's lovely wonderful. having you on. I know you're waiting. You've got more guests coming and you were supposed yes. to come. But they'll get here. It's, for it's a little bit rainy outside and things are happening. Yes. Thank you for coming on. Thank She's amazing, on. isn't she? She's amazing. Don't forget to look her up. Thank you we'll so much. We'll be back. Much.